Hello Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the month of December. Please do bear in mind that these are general readings so may not resonate for everybody. Do take what doesn't leave, what doesn't. So I'll be reading from the coffee cup and then also I'll be pulling out some cards towards the end. This is the Tarot of the Divine deck that I have here. And also I have the beautiful Sufi Wisdom Oracle deck also. Both links are in my description box. Um, okay, Scorpio, let's begin. Scorpio, Scorpio. Hmm. I'm seeing two kind of polarizing things here, like two very opposite things, but the the positive definitely outweighs this other bit that felt like a deterrent for you for some time, a certain fear that held you back is no longer. I see something here that, okay, I see a party. Maybe some of you have been invited to a party. I mean, I know it's December, but it, it is coming through, um, you know, December holidays and all that, but something is coming through. There is a connection here that you felt like you were held back from for a long time and this is what I, I I'm coming um through from from what I was saying with with the kind of negative and positive there was some sort of fear um a fear that you felt like you had no control over and this is something that's really really turning around um you're allowed to have a good time and you're allowed to have good things happen to you. I know you want that. For some reason, there's something here, you know, and it could be deep in your subconscious that you um, perhaps didn't always allow yourself to have a good time. And that's what's coming through is that there's a lot of times that is going to be very happy and good and lots of playful times you know just just enjoying the moment enjoying the moment there's a lot of emotions coming through Scorpio for you here there's a lot of emotions <laughs> gosh sorry I'm feeling it right now it's just <sighs> you have such a greater purpose here on earth so much greater than you ever realized about yourself for yourself. And I see when you start to relax and really enjoy yourself and, and, and be spontaneous as well, because I feel like there was a lot of control with what you were doing, you know, always kind of maybe not completely uh, fully participating in this or whatnot. You know, when it, there's this flow that starts to happen, a lot more, less resistance and a lot more starts to happen for you. You know, there's certain manifestations here that is coming through. Um, I see a secret also. A secrets could be coming through also for the month of December. Lots of secrets uh, that will, some secrets will throw you off. You are not expecting that, but it's, not something that um, you can't deal with. There is something here that you're silencing some people. You're putting things to rest. And, I, and, and also that is why there's an appreciation for these secrets coming through. That's what I see here. There's an appreciation. You're silencing some, some things um, and it will go. It will disappear. You don't need to worry about that anymore. I see here you're being, becoming very distinguished in your field, in whatever it is that you do, you're becoming very distinguished, you're known for that, there's a lot of appreciation. Um, there's a butterfly effect, a really strong butterfly effect, Scorpio. Things will ripple through, so whatever is like a cause and effect, your transformation that is happening will have a really big butterfly effect throughout you know, the ages throughout main, throughout a, a very long period in your life, um, like, like a domino effect, you know. 
and you're making sure that you begin this transformation in the best way possible so it continues positively, it continues in the way that you want it. You're freeing yourself from whatever burden that you have had on you and you know sometimes we don't realize that we've put the burden on ourselves and you are removing that there's a there's there's something that is awakening within you and there's also something here that is like of a concrete decision you're deciding something and there's no turning back and that's it it's one way it's go it's very very concrete um and once you've decided this that's it you know there's there's only one way and that one way is, is going forward for you. There is something that you feel like needs to be fixed and it is being fixed. There is a solution to something that you felt was a little bit negative, could be in terms of a close relationship that you had with somebody that is being, um, you know, it's, it's, it's no longer kind of, you can no, it can no longer stay quiet. Something is coming to the surface and beyond and it will be solved. It will be solved. Um, you're handling situations a lot better now. And I love to see this. But there is, you know, something that you're freeing yourself from. And this is like the least resistance will start, things will start to transpire. Dreams will start to transpire. A big cause and effect here. You know, now you're taking the actions that you once thought you was impossible. But yes, absolutely it is. Absolutely. It's like something you've been dreaming of, something you've been dreaming of, you know, pondering, should I, should you not? No, let me just leave it. It's silly or whatever. Or like, you know, it's coming to the forefront because you're like, oh gosh, I'm not afraid of failing. You've already won. You already won. You, you, there's no such thing as failing here because you're trying, but you're succeeding in every way, you know. Um, I, I see something very specific in terms of a yellow bird. I know that's very specific, but, you know, like, <laughs> like the cartoon character Tweety. <laughs> if that connects to some of you, please do let me know. But I do. I see. I see Tweety. Uh, but, I, you know, a canary, a canary bird, a canary... Um, you know, something so cute and gentle, but very, very powerful as well. Could be some a bringer of news that comes to you, you know, that will help shape how you go forward. Also money, I see you saving a lot more. Saving money is, is becoming very, very, a lot more important to you. You're looking really at the future where you put your money as well, making things a lot more secure. So that's very good to see. Your finances are becoming secure, saving a lot more, becoming smarter with decisions. See what the cards have for you. Seven of coins, seven of coins. Scorpio, seven of coins, four of swords. Scorpio, 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 King of Coins, lovely. Seven of Coins, Four of Swords, and King of Coins. Things are not going to stay as they are. You know, things are not going to just be like, oh, yes. And you go out, you come back, you sleep, da, 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 same thing. Something is changing. Where you, It's like a, you know, definitely, you know, your work is... You're being recognized for something. I do see. I do see that it, you could be getting an increase in your finances here. What's coming through, and it may have taken some time. Um, you may have not heard something, but it will come through in a really kind of a surprising way, like a gift of some sort, you know. But also, the Four of Swords is telling you to um, to listen, listen to that voice within you, listen to that inner voice that perhaps you haven't paid attention to for a long, long time. And once it comes through, you become the king or the queen of, of your world, of your life. You become fully in control. There is great stability that's coming through. There is like this, um, you know, you, 
allowing yourself to feel this joy, this growth, there is a lot of abundance coming through. There is a lot of growth coming through from something that you started. You see healthy roots are coming through. I also see something about your health is improving, you know. Um, things are, and this stability and security is a great, great thing. Um, but there is something that you're going to feel a lot more excited about and take certain chances. Page of Wands. Scorpio and the Nine of Swords. Page of Wands and yeah, things will come forward for you, you know, and it's just you in, in your subconsciousness here with the Nine of Swords to kind of allow those Nine of Swords, to place them on the ground, you know, they're not going to stop you. The, the, whatever Swords were, there's no um, ending to the to this opportunity because you've called for it you've called for this page of once you've called for this this incoming news that's coming through and yes you are ready scorpio the nine of of swords it's like oh okay now i have it in front of me what do what, what, can i do this yeah absolutely you can absolutely you can you know and this is just certain things that you um, are dealing with and very very well also something to do with your patience i'm getting here the nine of swords to do with your patience uh yeah be patient about it be patient about uh what you are working on what is coming forward as well you know there is um here that i see with a page of one something that you have had in your mind and you see it come through something that's been on your mind is coming through and it has so much growth potential. You're being seen. Don't be afraid to be seen. You're being seen. And I feel like that's why the Nine of Swords is like, oh, um, you know, you let's say you want to be, you know, example, you want to be famous. Let's say. This is just an example. But finally, when fame comes to in front of you, you're like, oh, no, I don't think I could do this. I'm too shy. I'm too scared. Of... That is changing. Don't allow fear to hold you back so that kind of transformation that butterfly effect that we were talking about is coming through the hermit yeah there's a lot of internal work is, is needing to be uh done that you are doing you know and i get here with this beautiful gazelle in the background the strength and luck and love that's coming through the self-love this learning to love yourself again but in a better way putting yourself forward putting yourself first as well you know learning from 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 things that have happened before and how you take it forward also you there's an enlightenment happening here with the hermit and it's something that is very positive a really big positive effect that's happening for yourself it is it, it is a perfect time to really go deep down into those those chords those strings that you have within you and take them out free yourself absolutely free yourself the hermit is a powerful card i feel i don't feel like I need to even take any cards out after this. This is the one that that is, you know, you're being true to your soul um, and you are able to handle absolutely anything. You're able to handle anything. But, you know, welcome the exciting new um, news that's coming through. You know, it could be a big, big, big change in your finances and luck is what I'm, I'm getting also, Scorpio, for you. And yeah, you can absolutely do it. I feel like, you know, this is going to take you uh, to the top in many ways. You know, you have such a clarity that's coming through also with the hermit. The hermit gives you a lot of clarity, a lot of truth. This is the start of something so big, uh, high potential, massive growth. Are you ready? I, I think so. Accepting challenges. Look at that. Isn't that perfect? Sorry for slamming that. Look at that accepting challenges oh scorpio yes 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 you see trust your inner resources could this be any more perfect could this look at that triple confirmation scorpio 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 accepting beautiful confirmation you see that light shining through yes accepting the challenges you are accepting it you are 
you are being open to it. This is beautiful confirmation that once you do this, things start to open up. Things are manifesting. There's something in your mind that you have had. Bring it forward. Connecting to certain people in your past is what's coming through as well. I, I feel here somebody from your past, you know, maybe there was some nervousness in there. It's all happening in a beautiful way. Connecting, connecting. And, and what is meant to be will be. You will feel it, but it's bringing you a source of abundance here. Trust your inner resources. Absolutely. And here's the hermit as well. Trust your inner self, as I was saying. Look at that. And it will happen. You see it here. And you know what you're capable of so much more than you realize. Scorpio, love this. I really hope that this was helpful. Please do take care of yourselves. Please do like, share, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Love you all. Thank you so much for being here. Until next time.